What's poppin' everyone? We are back on Pokemon Showdown today for another OU Live. I'm bringing that new heat, okay? I got a really heat Licky Licky set for the OU tier that I made. I've never used this Pokemon in OU before, so I wanted to build a team around it. And as you can see, I have a team with Fire EMZ, Swords Dance, 3 attacks, Licky Licky. Alright, check this out. Max attack, max speed, and force for death. So, essentially, right, this thing's gonna be hitting really hard after a Swords Dance. The purpose of this Pokemon is to destroy Steel-type Pokemon. Um, so this thing is going to be still faster than things like bulky Mega Scizors, Magirnas, Ferrothorns, bulky Celesteelas, and all kinds of like slower fat steel Pokemon, right? So this thing will just destroy them with Fire MZ, Fire Punch, after Swords Dance, or even before it can do a lot of damage. Also hits up that defensive heat trend with Earthquake, that's always useful. And then we have the main move here, Explosion, okay? We got Swords Dance, Explosion, Licky Licky, so I'm hoping we can see a couple booms here and there. Um, that should be pretty fun. I, I mean, I could have rocked with like Return or, uh, I don't know, Facade or something. I could have done something like that, but nah. I'm here with the boom, okay? I'm here to go boom on something um, with Licky Licky. And um, I decided to pair this Pokemon with Mega Glalie. And the reason is because Mega Glalie doesn't appreciate bulky steel types, especially um, Mega Scizor, right? So Licky Licky can kind of bait Mega Scizor to stay in and then Fire MZ Fire Punch it and knock it out. So I think the pairing of these two go well together. Freeze Dry is a really unique move on this thing as it has some pretty good mixed offenses. So Freeze Dry hits up the water type Pokemon super effectively, does a lot of damage to them. The Pokemon that normally switch into ice type moves sometimes take super effective damage from that Freeze Dry, so that's always useful. Earthquake of course, and another Explosion Mon. You already know, I got double Explosion Core right here. <laughs> that's why I figured they'd go so well together. Um, but yeah, then I have a, a Magirna, so AV Magirna, just really nice in dealing with Tapu Leles and stuff. You already know. Um, we got a Tornadus Therian, so Tornadus T for that defogging. Uh, it's really useful with the Rocky Helmet. And um, Seismitoad for rocks. Signature Chinese spread here. Memorize this number, it might save your life one day. And finally, Koma O, which is a sub belly drum set. Usually you see this thing with, I think, Thunder Punch, but I didn't really want to get walled by Lando. And uh, I mean, like, I guess Drain Punch can help. I, I don't know. I, I figured Rock Slide was kind of useful, actually, because. Um, it Oko's stuff like Volcarona and things too, which, um, you know, th Thunder Punch, you're kind of risking a burn with it, and, um, just a really helpful mon to sort of check Volcarona, and, um, yeah, it's pretty useful in that regard. And so, yeah, that's basically the squad here. Let's just go ahead, hop into a game, and see how we do with, um, with Licky Licky. I definitely hope that it puts in work, uh, a lot of work for this one. And as you can see, we're up against a Sticky Webs squad. Very dangerous for sure. Um, I think what I'm gonna do is uh, is perhaps just lead Magirna. Um, and Iron Head here. I should be able to actually defog later on. Um, and he's just gonna parry turn one. So beautiful, beautiful. And parry turn two. Ah, nice. We'll play this game then, that's fine. I go Torn, knock him out with the Hurricane. Nice, dodged. I kind of knew I would too. I had a feeling. Two Paras, I was definitely gonna dodge it. I, I should have gone back into my gear now, but <laughs> I forgot my speed tiers. He goes Kiram, um, we're just gonna get rid of this thing with Defog, get rid of the webs here. He's not Scarfed, I don't, I don't think he's Scarfed. So yeah, get rid of the webs and um, even live the hit. Ooh, not bad. Which means I can U-turn into Magirna. As he fusion bolts, I can now click Volt Switch here. And uh, let's just go into... I want to say just Glalie, right? We just go right into Glalie. Mega Evolve. Hit him with the uh, the Frustration. So he doesn't really have the best switches into this thing. So Kiram is going to take a hefty chunk of damage. 53%, so that's pretty nice. He actually has Draco. He really just came in with the Draco. So we knock him out here. That's pretty useful. Um, I'm guessing he's going to go into Crawdon or Greninja. Either or. And it's going to be Greninja. So Magirna probably takes the Dark Pulse. I don't know if he'd go for the water move. He might though, but like, I don't know. I don't really know. So yeah, we go Magirna. He goes right for the Dark Pulse. Yeah, we eat that up. We eat that up. I could Flur Cannon here for like a ton of damage. Um, so I'm going to do that. He just goes hard pincer. Nice dodge. Um, 
Yeah, nice, nice, nice. I have to go hard torn, I think. Quite unfortunate. So he's gonna mega, go right for the close combat. We take that. He's gonna quick attack here for sure, for sure. Um, so we're gonna go into size until on the quick attack. Eevee spreads at work. I'm gonna toxic here as he returns. Get this thing uh, nice and chipped. Quick attack should knock me out now, so I'm gonna just stay in Hurricane this. I'm a max HP set, so this should be good. Um, yeah, Hurricane this thing. Decent damage, I can just U-turn now. I think, unless this thing is Scarfed. But I think my play is to U-turn. No, this thing is... I did way little damage than I thought, but I guess because I'm not invested or anything. Ah, nice, Gren. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah, so here I can go Licky Licky, right? And I can just click... Uh, probably just click Earthquake here. As it goes Crawdont. Got some big damage on that. Okay, okay. And, uh... <laughs> I could boom, but like I I'd rather just stay in an attack. He's gonna probably try to get into his battle bond form. So, I guess I don't really need... I mean, I have to sack something. He just shurikens. Oh, okay, so is he locked into shuriken? Because then I can just go into this. And click sub. So I think this kind of works, right? Because like I can just sub with this. In comes Lottie. Actually, no, I want to keep this thing healthy so that it can check the Gren. If I get this thing lowered, Gren can probably pick it off. Ooh, he just healing wished up. <laughs> and now he's going to realize he gets o by Rock Slide. So that is uh, phenomenal. So, oh, of course I missed my Rock... Dude, that is so crazy. That is crazy. This guy's hack. This guy's a hacks noob. Come on, man. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. All right. Um, I'm a hurricane here. Knock this out. Yeah. Oh, wait, why would you go hard, Grin? Like, why? I don't get it. Cause you're no. There's no way you're dodging this thing. There's no way you're dodging this hurricane. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> that's what I thought. Alright, on to the next one, on to the next one. Oof, okay, first game. Licky Licky put in a little bit of work, so not too bad. Got to see it on the stage. Let's see what we can do for game two. With, uh, with the Sun team. So, let's see if we can make Licky Licky put in work. So, it's going to get the power, it's going to get the power of the Sun. The power of the Sun, right? Um, so, I'm going to leave with it, actually. As he leads Venus, he just straight up leads Venusaur. This is not a Mega, too, because I'm just going to Inferno Overdrive. Oh, he just went Hard Torkoal. Well, I mean, my I guess my hits are going to be pretty strong now. SD up. Nice, nice damage. Nice damage. He actually burned me. Charizard's in. Yo, watch me live the hit. Oh, we eat that up. Boom. You want to know how, how come we took less damage there because of cloud nine so i think maybe our fire moves would not have done as much damage because of the sun because we have cloud nine but the cloud nine saved us though we got rid of uh we got rid of zard we can torquil a, a bunch as well um so i'm gonna go here into tornadus as uh i should be able to just defog here i think defogging is my play he just went hard wait he just went hard venusaur hold up I'm gonna hit a 50% 50 50 accurate hurricane right there. And confused. Um, I get to go into Magirna now. Hopefully he doesn't weather ball. Ah, we never we'll never know. We'll never know. Okay, so now I guess I guess we're the ones that are hacking here. Not bad. See, what goes around comes around, okay? <laughs> uh, he's trapped me, so I'm AV. I'm not really I don't really mind. So uh yeah, let me just HP fire. Pick this thing off. Plus two special attack. Magnezone is back. Um, yeah, you're not doing damage to me. Gardevoir and D-Knight are left. Yo, but we got to see Licky Licky on the field, though. We got to see Licky Licky go boom, all right? <laughs> that's, what we want. that's what we need to see. All right, let's move on to the next one. Solid game, solid game. Always great to see Licky Licky putting in the work. Um, this guy's using my team. 
<laughs> this guy is using my squad here with the Tauros. Not bad. It's not every day you get to face your own team and lose to it. Um, but yeah, so... It's time I get beat down. Hello. Um, yeah, I, I, I guess what we could do is Lee Torn. This is a, um, a Custap Skarm, I think. <laughs> True. So if I remember correctly, AV Lando. Actually, I think Coma opens in some good work. I'm gonna knock off here, get rid of the Custap. Get rid of the Custap is nice, I think. This goes Kiram. Getting rid of his Choice Scarf. Actually, that's pretty good for uh, for Coma O. Now nothing can outrun it after Belly Drum. So here, I guess I could just go right for the U-turn uh, into Magirna, and then probably double here into Glalie. Let's go Skarmory. Okay, I get to go now hard Torn. And just defog, I think, is my play. And Mawile's in. Okay, so Mawile being in, we now have to um, use her now. I think this is the power punch set. I think this is my my favorite power punch. Mawile. I forgot how much speed I put on it though. That's the, that's the only thing. Um, I should not have got hard into this, but like, he probably won't expect it to do anything. I don't think he'd sucker punch here. He definitely play off again. And then we take him off and we hopefully take him off guard. Oh we got Skarm. Actually, this is not bad. This is not bad at all. Cause Skarmy takes some damage. We should be faster than it and knock it out with Fire Punch. Or not, because I forgot it. <laughs> I put max speed on it. Um, but this works because now we can still defog. Skarmory's gone, which means that he can't really check it with Como. -O. And uh yeah, it's not bad at all, actually. Not bad at all. I believe I have HP fighting on this uh, on this set here. I don't know. My teams are pretty good. I'm a boom. He just body slams. And that is all fine in the world. Um, this thing is fast, though. <laughs> this thing is definitely fast. Um, I think I go... I think I go Torn. I'd probably just click Defog here. I think I live a Body Slam. I live an Ice Beam as well. He can't freeze me or anything either. Um, I'm gonna save Torn. I think I'm just going to go right for the U-turn into Magirna, take the hit, and then fire off a Floor Cannon. We should hit basically everything on his team, I'm thinking, so yeah. Yep, there's Lando. It's the AV Lando set. I could go back to Torn, but like, I, I remember this thing has like a Rock Tomb or something. I'll go Seismitoad here. Seismitoad's a good play. As, um, yeah, this should be good. Rock Tomb, exactly, exactly. Beautiful. Tornadus is my play here, I think, on his U-turn. Uh, oh, actually, I don't think I have U-turn on this set. Yeah, this works. U-turn here, get myself some more Regenerator Health. Get back up and go to Seismitoad. Probably just Scald here now. This is probably, he, he might just Rock Tomb again. Actually, Rocks, ooh, Rocks might be nice though. Ooh, Rocks might be nice. Let me get my Rocks up. I should probably click them. Switch out here into my Torn, I think, is the play. Yup, yup, beautiful. And uh, go right for the U-turn. I think we eat this earthquake up. I'm pretty sure we do. So I'm gonna stay in and click nothing. Never mind. I thought I lived that, but that, the Chinese spread, you know, it, it only comes through half the time. <laughs> it only comes through half the time. Um, Glalie's actually looking really nice right now. Glalie's looking clean, very clean. But do I die to a, a Tauros' attack? That's the that's the ultimate question. 
That is the question. I'm gonna save you. Go into this thing. Click the, I could click knockoff so they can make it weaker. Or I could just hurricane and blow it back. And I'm just gonna blow it back with the hurricane. And we confuse, ooh, unfortunate. I would not have been knocked out by any hit though, but still. That's, uh, that's pretty good. So here versus this thing, we're just going to, um, I think the play is just to hurricane. I could also go, I, actually hard combo is not bad either. Hard combo, no, but he has the ghost team still. He, has, he still has the ghost team. So we're gonna hurricane this for some damage and then go hard Magirna, I think is my play. Because if he burns the uh, ghost team, like what he just did right there, Como walls him. So that's a huge, huge problem uh, for him. Right, so now I think I just uh, Fleur Cannon this. He goes Mawile. Um, he will be faster under Trick Room. So my play is to just chip him down with uh, Tornadus, I think. Rocky Helmet Tornadus. Should chip him down a bunch. Power Up Punch, yep, yep, beautiful. Kind of all I need, actually. He's going to play rough here, right? So my play is to just sack, I think. Yeah, sack here. Um, I was trying to. <laughs> I was I was really trying to. It's a good team though. It's definitely a good team. Takes a lot of people by surprise. GG fam. Um, so yeah, got to face our own team. Not every day that not every day that happens. It's a pretty fun squad overall. I recommend you all try it. Pay spins in the description of that video. But um. Yeah, let's move on to the next one. Move on to the next one right now. So pretty good overall. Got to see Licky Licky knock out the uh, Skarmory in that one. And this one we actually have a game where Licky Licky might just put in a ton of work. Literally a ton of work. This might be pretty exciting. I think my my play is to lead Licky Licky <laughs> and just blow something back immediately. How about we do that? How about we just do that right now? Please, please, please stay in with your Feral Thorn and do not click any other move. I want you to see the power of li the power of Licky Licky. Oh, we did we didn't knock it out though. That is unfortunate. Did not knock it out. Um, that's fine. I I think I don't know. Would he protect here? Cause I could just SD up and fire punch. I'm gonna earthquake here. He's probably gonna go uh, Heatran. I think. Oh, it was Lando. That's unfortunate. That is truly, truly unfortunate. What a waste. I should have just fire punched again, but like I wouldn't I didn't expect any of that stuff to happen. So he trends in. So if this thing I'm not sure what set this might be. But Seismitoad here will save the day. Probably just click my uh earthquake here. <laughs> as he taunts. So goodbye, goodbye. Yeah, I got to see the fire MZ though. That was nice. At least. Um, here we just go into Tornadus, as he Leech Seeds, Como O is my switch in now. Can I beat Landorus is the question. I might be able to. Might be able to. Ooh, Weavile. Good switch in. Good switch in on my thing. I'm just gonna... i probably just Volt here. Yep. Into Como O. Go right for the uh, sub as he goes finny. I don't think I knock him out here though, but I'm gonna try. I am gonna try my best to hit him up for some clean damage. Yeah, nice and clean, nice and clean. <laughs> this is why they're, I guess this is why they're on Thunder Punch, right? But Rock Slide Flinch is the wave. Weavile's gonna be forced to Ice Shard me here and then I'm gonna click um, Fleur Cannon on the incoming Landorus, beautiful. So bouncing back from that, Unfortunate circumstance here. Oh, nice. <laughs> I just, uh, I guess I really am the uh, the hack lord out here. Um, Buzzwell is in, so I'm gonna go hard torn on this. He tries to earthquake. Beautiful. And now I get to, I get to hurricane this thing. 
for some damage. Knock off his item. Hurt himself? Do we hurt himself? Do we see that? Yeah, we do. Ob we obviously do. Obviously. Um, hurricane this. And uh, yeah, he does get he's, he does get the seeds off. Um, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go Magirna. HP fire. Uh, this thing. He does not really have a safe switch in. And I think we just win in the end with uh, Glalie as well, if I'm not mistaken. So knock this out. In comes the Buzzwool. I guess I just sack... Uh, I just go Torn. As he subs? Okay. Sub Ice Punch. Yep, Hurricane knocks him out. Last Pokemon's going to be that Weavile. And we just sack our Tornadus. It probably just knock us out anyways. With the Icicle Crash... And we can finish it in style with, I guess, Magirna. Or, this thing is banded, right? Let's finish it in style with Glalie. And kaboom. Should probably knock him out. It's like a 300 power attack. Yep, 300 power boom. GG. Ah, nice, nice, nice. <laughs> Not bad. Okay, moving on to the next one. So we got to see Licky Licky with the Fire MZ. Um, unfortunately, I thought he would switch after that and preserve Ferrothorn for like half my team. But on to the next one. On to the next one. Um, so here we go. And he actually did have Protect on the last game too, so... He definitely made a play there, but we... We played. We definitely played ourselves. Um, this guy has... Like a team that's weak to Glalie? It looks really weak to Glalie actually, doesn't it? Like I feel like we could just... Lead with... Um, probably Torn. He leads Weavile. I go hard Magirna. I go hard Magirna here. On the knockoff. Okay, so that's not too bad. I have Volswitch here as... He's going to go Mag Magnezone, I think. Yep. Nice, nice. Seismic Sword is my play. I get rocks up here. Get the big rocks up. Venusaur, yep. Perfect, perfect. Tornadus is the switch in right here. He might just double... I can see him doubling or just sludge bombs, so that works pretty well. I get to U-turn out here versus this thing on any incoming Mon. Probably gonna be okay. So it's Magirna. Let's uh, let's get some okay. Let's get some big damage with Licky Licky. Let's get some big damage here. This is the AV Magirna, so let's get big damage right now and chip this thing down a lot. Good damage, good damage. Vol switches out here, so not bad. Got to see some of that uh, some of that stunting right there. In comes Garchomp, so I could, I, could, I could boom here, or I can switch out. I think I'll switch out into Torn as he gets up rocks. Fair enough. Um, gonna double the size until Actually, I think my play is to just Hurricane, I think. Because keeping rocks on his side is pretty useful. And this thing is like a bulkier chomp, I think. Or not. It's just a really powerful chomp. I'm so lucky in this video. I'm too lucky in this in this game, in this uh, in this series. Ah, not bad, not bad. All right, not bad. Let's let's uh, we'll switch out. I mean, he, he got a little okay. He got a little revenge on me there. A little bit of revenge. Um, fair enough, I guess. I think Licky Licky takes a hit, and I should be able to. Fire Punch. Oh, there we go. Licky Licky, come through, buddy. Come through. Go ahead and come through. Licky Licky just destroyed the uh, Weavile and chunked that Magirna down a bunch. He goes Landorus. I'm going to boom. Uh, there's no point in saving this thing. So this is probably going to be Scarfed Landorus. Probably Scarf Lando. So Simon took us to come in here. I get to double into Torn, and I get to defog. I want to keep my Glalie at full, so defogging is definitely the play. I get to now click U-turn versus this pretty safely, and he can't break the core now. Like he can't break this anymore. Double back to Torn. Knock off on the Venu on the incoming. 
Nothing, okay. Begirna, okay, dodged. It's all it's all good, it's all good. Perfectly fine. You turn here into Toad. As he flirt cannons, not too bad. I could get my rocks back up here. I think that's a fine play. And that's gonna be nice because like he can't get up his own rocks anymore, right? So this should be great. Actually, you know, Como O does indeed block the bulletproof. Yep. Beautiful. I can now double into Glalie. As he leech sees me, oh, okay, that's fine. So he has leech seed on that thing. Good to know. Um, double back into Como O here. Probably on his sludge bomb is what I'm thinking. Or as he goes Magnezone. Okay, that, that works pretty well. Because I can just drain punch here. Force him into Lando to take chip. Go into Torn. Give him Rocky Helmet if he U-turns. And if he stays in, then that's uh, a bit unfortunate for him. Check this out, right? Oh, Defog. Okay, that works. Switch out here into Seismitoad. Earthquake on this thing. Knock it out. Right. Perfect, perfect. So, Magirna gone. Venusaur comes back in. I get to go Torn. I get to U-turn out here. Into Koma-O. And then just go for the sub. Because now if I sub, he cannot hurt me at all. And that's going to be GG, I think, because now I get the Salak Berry boost. I'll still be slower than, yeah, Scarf, but I'll still knock it out with Drain Punch at plus six. Good game, good game. Um, on to the next one right now, on to the next one. So getting close to that 40-minute uh, mark, maybe a couple more games, we'll, we'll see how we do. It's uh, It's been a fun live. It's been a fun one. I'll, uh, I'll give it that. We've been super fortunate, but we got to see like some fun Licky Licky maneuvers. Um, Mega Gallade, big threat overall. Don't got much for it, but we will still try to win this game. I think we can. I think we can. Look at this guy's name. That is not me. I see you. <laughs> I don't. I, what, what trainer is this from? Is this a custom one? It might be a custom trainer. Um, I think my play is just to get rocks up. He is probably just going to switch into Kartana. It's the only good switching that he has. And now, like, he's going to try to defog, wear the Seismito down and stuff, but it's not going to work because I do have Toxic on this Zapdos. Oh, sorry, on the um, Seismito. Just use it on the Zapdos. And I'll get up my rocks again. Get my rocks up back here. Put this Zapdos nice and low. I don't, I don't know if he roosts here. He might roost. But I win this exchange 100% of the time. So he should switch. Yep, switches out. Beautiful, beautiful. I uh, I Toxic here. He goes for Trick. Ah, so he tricked me a Choice Specs. I wonder if I... I don't know if I like that a lot. <laughs> I don't know if I really like that. I don't think I appreciate that too much, my friend. Um, I think I just go... Magir, no? Does he vote switches? I was thinking of I was thinking of staying and clicking toxic again, but it's all, it's okay. It's all good. I'm gonna go torn and then click. Uh... Oh, and then you know what I do? I double to Glalie. Double to Glalie here, right? Mega freeze dry. Hit him with the freeze dry. Get the big damage off on that. Dodge the wisp too. Beautiful. <laughs> Absolutely beautiful. Ah, Not bad at all. Frustration, knock him out. So Rotom is gone. That's pretty good. Uh, Glade, huge threat is in. I go. Have, I have to go hard, Torn. Like, I can't sack anything else. Everything else is kind of useful. Close combats, yep. That, yep, yep. I could U-turn, but then I don't want to get static, right? So I'm going to hard switch into uh, Glalie. Yep, on the Magir. Now, that actually works... Pretty well, I would say. Pretty well. Now, if I want to make a real play, I'm going to go Seismitoad on this. Take this hit, right? Fire off a Specs Scald. A Choice Specs Scald. 316 Special Attack. Not too impressive. Not too impressive. But it'll do damage. 
It'll knock out Zapdos easily. <laughs> Watch him go hard, Kartana. Nah. Alright, so Flurkins again. I'll get a little bit more chip on this thing. And then we are going into our Licky Licky. And we're going to have some fun with the Fiery and Z. Going to blow this thing back. He'll probably Volt Switch here. He'll probably Volt Switch. Yup, stays in. Licky Licky with the Fire and Z, Inferno Overdrive. Knocked out the Magearna. Knocked out the Magearna. So in comes Gallade. He's gonna S he's gonna predict the um okay, never mind. <laughs> I really thought he was gonna predict Torn. To switch in that time. But at this point in time, uh we just click Hurricane on everything. Lando comes in here. I would assume that he'd click boom. I would assume he'd click boom here, so I'm gonna go into my Magearna. Yep. That works. Special attack increased. I'm gonna go torn because he's not clicking ice punch this time. Except he gets a critical hit. A critical hit. And we knock him out. So that works. I am perfectly fine with that. Uh, smart strike here will knock me out more than likely. Ah, he's Swords Dance. So hopefully not a speed boosting set because that could be a little bit problematic. Um, actually, I do believe I can take a hit from this. Drain punch my health to a really decent amount. I am out of range. So I live this hit. Yup, just down 1%. And we win the game. So, solid game. Crit didn't matter here. That was close. That was a pretty, pretty good game. GG, GG. Good game. Alright, not bad. Um, let's, uh, let's grab maybe one or two more. Keep it going see how we do on this one this guy has a pretty cool team he's got the size and toad. however he's not the Chinese it's not the Chinese size and toad that I got here this is a, a matchup where I think the rock slide comes into handy because it will destroy um, Volcarona with the uh, coma o rock slide I think that that's gonna come into play quite a bit um, I'm gonna leave Glalie as he leads um, Tornadus I can just mega and I can click Frustration, I think. As he just U-turns out. So maybe he goes into Seismitoad. Maybe he goes Seismitoad here. Who knows? But hopefully not hard Volcarona. Yeah, Celesteel. Okay, this, this is going to be good. Let's see how much damage this does. 49%. Not too bad. Not too bad. In all honesty. Um, would he... I, I guess he'd Leech Seed here? Maybe? Yeah, Leech Seeds. Beautiful. I can just go here into my Licky Licky. As he tries to protect, this works. I can now Inferno Overdrive and knock out this Celesteela. So that's phenomenal. Get rid of this Pokemon here. And uh, <laughs> I love the number of times we've clicked Inferno Overdrive in this one. I'm going to Swords Dance up. I wonder what he's going to do. Combine's here. Let's go ahead and knock out this Reuniclus. <laughs> nice. So another Pokemon gone. Back into Glalie we go as he goes into Gyarados. Freeze Dry here now, I think. Um, this might be Mega, though. But Freeze Dry, I think, is the play. As, um... Maybe he'll DD in regular. Never mind, he Megas. Freeze Dry this for some damage. He Dragon Dances up. That's fine. I think we just go Torn. Tornadus, so we can give him a little bit of chip damage on this. Should be good. Um, yeah, that's fine. And then I think that Seismic Toad should live a hit. Seismic Toad should definitely live a hit. So I'm going to go into that. I don't want my Como getting weakened. This thing is my Volcarona answer. So I'm going to click Earthquake here. I should live. Knock him out. So that's great. Um, of course, now Volcarona being probably the Mon... I mean, I don't know. I don't think he'll go into it just yet to set up with it. I don't think he would. He goes Torn. Right. Right. Just like I thought. And uh, I go hard Magirna as he clicks Knock Off. Okay. Fair enough. Um, do I? F I think I just. I think I flare cannon. Yep, onto the Silent Toad. This thing is pretty spadef bulky. Pretty spadef bulky. Um, I can go here in a Glalie because I do pack freeze dry. He earthquakes. Okay, fair enough. I. I think freeze dry is the play. Yep. So it's times four super effective on this thing. Very nice. Um, I can now click. I can now proceed to clicking. Boom. Yeah, boom on this should be good. I wonder if it knocks it out. 
It just O coded. What? That's crazy. That is absolutely crazy. Good lord. <laughs> That's gonna be GG. So we got to see the power of um of Licky Licky as well as Mega Glalie. Ooh, good combination. Um, on to the next one right now. So on a huge win streak here, doing well. Moving on to hopefully another great game. Hopefully another great game. This one's taking a little while to load compared to some of the other ones. But um, but yeah, I'm really enjoying this team a lot. Always appreciate uh, suggestions from you guys. I think I think Licky Licky was one of them from a while ago. And the Mega Glalie I think was also a suggestion from quite some time ago to bring it into the Ultra Sun and Moon OU tier. We're up against the Hail team, okay? I've not seen a Hail team in a long time, so um, it should be quite interesting, quite interesting to play. Now I'm gonna go ahead here, right? I'm gonna go ahead and lead with my trusty Glalie, because Glalie, as I'm sure you already know. It's gonna put in some work, I think. Oh, uh, Phytium. Or Sky Strike, okay, that, that just destroyed me. Um, I guess I go Magirna. I click, uh, yeah, I guess I click Volswitch here. And then go into my own Torn. Try to win a Speed Tie or something. It goes Pex, okay, perfectly fine. You turn out here. into so I think Komo has a chance of winning so I'm gonna go Licky Licky SD up here he's not gonna know what this thing does I'm sure do some big damage on that and then we should be faster than this thing so we can fire him actually just regular fire punch should, should take this out a regular fire punch should take this out Nice, nice. <laughs> Not bad. Licky Licky come through. Now he's scared, so he went Mamoswine. So we're going to go into uh, Seismitoad here. And he goes for the sub. So he's like a Snow Cloak set. Yeah, he's a Snow Cloak Mamoswine. I think. <laughs> okay. Not bad. Pick that thing off there. Um, we save this thing. Go into. I guess Magirna is fine. Click that nice and fast Vol Switch. Superpowers as I can just go into. Um... Yeah, Tornadus is fine. And just U turn out here as he goes hard Heatran. And all I get to do now is go into my Como O. Just go right for the sub. And then I think just Belly Drum. So I'll be faster than everything except for any potential Scarf Mons. So the Scarf Mon probably being Lele. I think I just Drain Punch here. I think I can Drain Punch this. He just goes Pex. So this thing should get knocked out here. Tapu Lele does indeed have the moon blast. I can sack Licky Licky at this point in time. Psychic, okay, fair enough. Um, I think I Iron Head here. He goes Heatran, okay. Um, my play is to then go Torn and click uh, Defog. Get rid of the rocks as he just sits him back up. So, fine with me. Um, I should be able to just Scald here, I think. Get some damage on this. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Um, nice. So Lele comes in now. How do we win this game? How do we win this game? Um, so he'll definitely take me out here. Ah, this is tricky. So it just depends what I need more. Do I need Coma O more? Do I need Seismitoad more? I feel like... I feel like I sack Coma O. Go Magirna. 
We'll switch here. Yeah, I think I have to Volt Switch here. But he knocked off my AV, right? So... Yeah, definitely uh, a close game for sure. A close game. I should have just, like, not played... I, w I was too... I was too, like... I was too on the climb. And I just was like, yeah, let me sack Lily turn one. That's my bad. Yeah, he made a... Yeah, he stayed in. Dang, that was... Man... All right, one game now. Okay, so let's let's grab another. Let's grab one more. Ended on a win. I could actually I could have won this game if I didn't play too recklessly with uh, Glalie. But we got to see Licky Licky just d dominate a little bit in that last one, or in the one before this one. And I think this is where we will end it off on this last game here. Should get us to that clean forty minute mark if we're not already there. Um, but yeah, so. I think let's just, uh, no, let's just lead, uh, Glalie, if I'm not mistaken. I think Glalie's a fine lead. Start a timer. Yep, yep. Beautiful. Just click that frustration here. This thing probably scarfed, is what I'm thinking, but... Maybe not. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> why did they? Why did they just sack their Lando? Why did they just sack it? This is exactly what I was trying to do on the um the other thing, the tornadoes. Yo, minus one. This thing should this thing should get knocked out too. Okay, why'd you double? You were predicting the seismitoad there, weren't you? <laughs> you were predicting the seismitoad. Um, so he heals up himself. I can just knock off here on anything that comes in. Get rid of the item on the uh, Mew. That works. You turn out is my play. I get to go here into Licky Licky as he T-waves me. Ooh. You know, Licky Licky is going to get a knockout here. It is about to get a knockout. T-wave Roost, okay. Ice Beam. So if that's the game we're going to play, I'm going to go ahead and just uh, destroy this thing right now with a plus four. Or times three, Inferno Overdrive. It lived? I think Earthquake knocks it out then, doesn't it? Yep, gone. Ah, nice. Licky Licky come through, buddy, come through. I'm gonna boom here. Are we just subbed? <laughs> okay, that's fine. I, I, I get to bring in Glalie now then, don't I? I get to bring in this thing. He goes grand, I could have, ooh, I could have freeze dried there. That's a 2 KO all, all on its own. That's a 2 KO. Not bad at all. Rock Slide. I'm a Vol Switch. I'm a Vol Switch here. Into, um... Into Seismitoad. And now I'm a Double. Into Tornadus. And now I'm gonna click Hurricane because I don't think you're switching. This time, I don't think you're switching. You're gonna, you're gonna stay and predict my U-turn. Yep. Just as I expected. I'm a U-turn now, though. Because now he knows I'm going to click Hurricane, but he stays in. He really just stayed in. What is this uh, a physical set? Like, what, what's going on here? Am I missing something? I'm a sub. Sub Belly Drum. <laughs> GG, GG. Um, not bad. Okay, so I think we're going to end it out there. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. We got a lot of great games in this one. A lot of great games. Only drop one, so that's not too bad. I don't usually drop a lot of games, but um, some once in a while. Once in a while, when I get too excited, I I, uh, <laughs> I slip a little bit. Then I get back on track. Yeah, let me know what you guys think about Licky Licky. I thought it was a great mod. Putting a lot of work was a really fun Pokemon overall. And feel free to suggest what you might want to see for the next OU Live. I love the suggestions. I'll be looking into all of them. And um, yeah, looking forward to hearing from you all. As always, I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.